five, four, three, two, one. Old school only is go. <laughs> G'day and welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to make this pick up a roller. I'm not feeling too good. Um, I've got a few dramas with my health, so I'm not going to be chatting too much. Um, today, I'm just going to get into it, stick on some music, and um, let's get a rear end in this thing. We'll push this thing outside and get some side perspective on the thing. I've been stinging to do that. So what I've decided to do with a lot of deliberation is I'm going to use the diff that's in the coupe. Um, it's ready to go. It's juiced up. It works. It's fine. Um, we'll chuck it in the pickup because this chassis is going to have. It's going to be engineered with a small block and a different diff and everything, so it's not even going to be in this thing anymore. So let's just use it. And if I want to modify one of those other ones later on that I've got up there, the V8 ones, happy days. Let's do that when I've got more time. So in the meantime, we'll chuck this in. We're not making big horsepowers. She'll be fine. Let's I do got it. cash in the bag, stadium pack. Born a rock star in this life, gone live it up on the attack. Baby, I'm bad. I just wanna get caught up in this life. I'm crazy, I'm bad. Doing no cap. Only God wants you better go live it up. Cash in the bag, stadium pack. Baby, I'm bad. Yeah. Baby, I'm bad. I just wanna stay bad, stay mad. Shit by my shoulder, cause they treat me like an outcast. I ain't gonna take that, stay back. I'll be swinging hard till the hits come in all caps. I ain't gonna lay back, pray that someone's gonna help me Ain't nobody like that I ain't gonna wait, that's all fact Give me one shot and I'll never get the thrown back I'm sick of being cautious, so I'ma go cautious Righto, so that's out And I think the easiest way to do this Is grab Model A rear cross member Chuck it in there Connect it to the gearbox And we'll have a rolling Fully connected running gear Righto, so I've got my Model A cross member just sitting in there. Um, I'm just got to work out how I'm going to mount it. I've got a couple of ideas. I've got a feeling it's going to be too high. The car's going to be too high with it there. I've got an uh, option of bringing it up to the highest part of this chassis, but it'll mean I'll have to notch the sides. Anyway, what I'm going to do now, I'm just going to slip the diff in, get an idea of the height. Uh, it's going to be light in the back. The tray doesn't weigh much. So it's going to pretty much sit how it's going to sit and we'll get a bit of idea on the rake. I think it's going to be too high, but anyway, we've got to try it, hey? I pray that someone's going to help me, ain't nobody like that. I ain't going to wait, that's all fact. Give me one shot and I'll never get the thrown back. I'm sick of being cautious. I'm going to go cause some pain, can't stop this. I'm going to steal everybody's lane, call it shoplift. Sick of hearing everyone complain when they thought this. Taste the pain, it's like candy canes It makes me go change into a better frame Into a better name, society's insane We all live for fame, yeah. Cash in the bag, stadium pack Born a rock star in this life, gonna live it up on the attack Baby, I'm bad, I just wanna get caught up in this life I'm crazy, I'm mad, do it no cap Only God wants you, better go live it up Cash in the bag, stadium pack Baby, I'm bad, baby, I'm bad see with the sun on my back there hey it's neat it looks good it actually looks really good but I'm telling you she's high off the ground Chazzy rail I'm not the tallest dude around but it's at the bottom of my shirt to get some perspective I don't know if you can see that but yeah nah we can't um we can't do it like that. Got a couple of ideas. One of them is to notch this. Another one is to bring this all the way to the top. Cut a hole 
in here and then run the spring through the chassis might work um, I could do it like a Model A and just cut it off um, cut it off and then put a chassis extension for the tray like they do on the Model A's the other option is I run parallel leaf springs which I could do it's just this was going to be easier but I can't like dead set let me get a better perspective hang on I don't know if that's a better perspective and yeah there's no front spring in this at the moment it's only going to come up a couple of inches with the spring in it it's if I was building a four-wheel drive it'd be perfect <laughs> give you an idea it's kind of like a lifted Nissan Patrol or a Land Cruiser at the moment at the back so yeah back to the drawing board But hey, on a positive note, it's a roller. It rolls. Nothing's stopping me from rolling it now. But I can't keep it like this. The dilemma. If I was building a um, Hot Wheels car, it would probably work, but I'm not. So I've been deliberating over the last couple of days of what to do, and I've got a plan. Let's get the grinder out. Righto, the first thing I've got to do is confirm, <coughs> excuse me, my wheelbase is 106 inches, which is almost where I've got it, so I'm just going to move it back just a little bit further, and that's the exact wheelbase this needs to be for a 32, so we'll mark that up, and then we're going to lop the back of this off. Mount this guy up in here. And then on a pickup model A, 32, 34, whatever, the tray doesn't sit directly on the chassis. It sits on another piece. So the other piece is what's going to bring out and what they do. It's going to bring the strength out for the back of the tray. So let's measure this up, lop it off, put the cross member in place. Then we'll make sure we're sitting at a decent height. And once we've sorted that out, then we can start getting, I've got some RHS which I can bring along and bring out to the back of the tray. It's going to get rid of a lot more weight. I'm not going to use that. It's too big, it's too, I mean it did look good at the back, but I was going to use it because it's there. We're going to get rid of it and I'll change it to something a little bit lighter. It doesn't need to be that strong, apart from what you're going to put in the tray. Hey Stinky, how you going mate? Well there you go, that's as low as I can go for lots of reasons without co completely changing the setup and I'm not too disappointed in that and once it's got a front spring in it the rake won't be as obvious and I think we've got ourselves a cool little hot rod. What I'm going to do now is just measure it up, make sure it's exactly in the right spot, I'll tack it in, put a couple of welds in it so it can hold on, um, we might make our rails for the tub real quickly 
put the tub on it, roll it outside and get a picture of it. as far as I can push that thing it slopes up in my backyard but check it out I'm pretty happy I haven't put those rails in the back yet so that um, tub will come up about three inches and yeah I think it's looking good looking real good I'm really happy she's um, almost ready to steer I've got the parts to make it steer I've got the parts to make it stop I do have to muck around with the pedal set up um, I've got suspension for it I've got wiring for it, um, I need to get a radiator, uh, and I've got to do a lot of panel work, but yeah, we're coming together real quick. Yeah, that's a good thing about these old cars, and I'm not spending a lot of time, I'm probably spending an hour a day, hour or two, um, I might spend an hour at a time, um, yeah, it's very easy, especially when you've got your plan, you know what you're doing, I guess, but I'm happy with the way that rear suspension worked. Let's have a look underneath. It'll do for now. I've got to obviously pull it all apart once it's all once I've got it all mocked up and ready. I'll strip it down, trim off stuff I don't need, weld up stuff that it needs to be welded properly, um, paint everything and put it back together. But yeah, we have a rolling hot rod. And it was only a few weeks ago this thing was just a bear shazzy that had been sitting in my mum's yard for like over 15 years unreal so if you like what you're seeing like subscribe all that stuff stay tuned be good to your mates and i'll see you on the next one cheers